You know what I'm not into? Parasitic worms in my eyeballs. Uh. <laughs> California woman contracts parasitic worms in her eye after going on a trail run. Yeah, I'm always encouraging people to go for a hike. <laughs> go uh, take a walk in the forest. Well, not so much for her. She's running in a place called... Uh, a place in Northern California. I don't know if they get any more specific than that. She's trail running in Carmel Valley near Monterey. And she's coming through an area. She's coming through a patch, Will. And there's a bunch of, there's a bunch of flies, like a swarm of flies. And she just runs through the swarm. And it's like, ugh, what was that? And kind of wipes off her face. Maybe a couple got in her mouth. Thinks nothing about it. Keeps going. But then, a little later on, her eye is sort of itchy. You know? She's, she gets back to her hotel or wherever she's staying or whatever. Her eye's a bit itchy, so she starts pouring a little bit of water in there. And as she's pouring the water, she, she feels something in there. It's a, it's a little, little worm in there. She picks that out. Imagine that Ugh. one. It grew that fast? I don't know. I guess I don't know. No, it didn't grow that fast. It, uh, it was March when she found a worm, actually. Oh. And and so it was a month later. Oh, I was living there. It was a month later. Her right eye started to bother her a month later. Oh, man. So you could be infected right now. Well, and you don't even know it. Mm -hmm. uh, the woman splashed tap water into the eye and a wriggly half-inch roundworm came out. She then found another one, which she also pulled out. She went to an eye doctor the next day who found a third one and instructed her to continue washing out her eye with distilled water. Oof. Imagine pulling a worm out of your eyeball, Will. This is very rare, by the way. It mostly affects cattle, not humans. It's a very rare type of worm. So the, the main question here is, did she lose an eye? I don't think so. I think she's all right. Not like that guy. The guy who was showering with the contact lens, I think he got it worse. Okay. I think she seems all right for now, but it's crazy. I get two stories on my feed in a relatively short span of time of the eyeball stuff. I feel like my whole life went by and I thought, ah, Ugh. you just take your eyes for granted and then all of a sudden worms are jumping out. Everybody's getting worms in their eyes and... Well, the other guy, like, you saw pictures of his eyes. It was very, very graphic. Yeah. These worms are everywhere, Will. So what's the, what's, the, what's the moral here? I don't know. Still go for the hike. I guess just watch out for swarms of flies and kind of maybe just take the detour. Mm -hmm. Or close your eyes. Or goggles. Goggles. Hiking goggles. Is that a thing? Now it is. After this uh, story, now it is. In the desert. There you have it, Will. Moral of the story, Mars. Moral of the story, there's no eyeball worms on Mars. They got a little no. bit of water, some phosphorus. There's no eyeball worms. Yeah, a little so, cold, but... No, no, let's not focus on that. You know. No eyeball worms. So, as far as I'm concerned, that's good enough. Yeah. Let's book the next trip. Call up Elon start to prepare because mm -hmm. we're going to Mars and we're never coming back.